Yo, it's your boy Vandroy Dr. Back again with another quick video. So I'm here with the Samsung Galaxy A17 5G Android phone. And in this video, I'll be showing you how you can increase the RAM using the RAM Plus feature. Okay, so this is the 4GB model. However, I do know that you can get the 6GB model and also the 8GB model as well. But however, this is the 4GB model and at times it is a bit laggy. So... Anyway, let's get into the video and I'm going to show you how to turn on the RAM Plus. So to find the RAM Plus option, just go ahead and follow my steps. So pull down the notification panel and go into the settings and then scroll all the way down to where it says device care. Then go ahead and select it. And like I mentioned, I have a four gigabyte model and I'm already using 2.2 gigabytes out of my four gigs. So that's more than half of my memory already getting used and I'm not even doing anything. I've got no applications open and I'm not even doing anything and half of my RAM is being used. So I've only got 1.2 gigabytes available out of my four gigs. Okay, so go ahead and select memory and Scroll down and you will see RAM Plus. Go ahead and select the option and just make sure that this little toggle switch is turned on. And here it explains about RAM Plus and how it works. So RAM Plus uses your phone's storage space to provide virtual memory. Choose more virtual memory to allow more apps to stay open in the background. Choose less virtual memory to keep more storage space free. So basically what this does is it's going, it's going to use some of my internal storage and it's going to convert it into virtual RAM. So remember, it's virtual RAM. It's not real physical RAM. Okay, so go ahead and select the four gigabyte option there. And then here it just explains that the phone needs to restart to change the amount of internal storage used as virtual memory. So yeah, the phone needs to restart, so go ahead and hit the restart option so that it can convert the internal storage into four gigabytes of virtual RAM. Okay, so now when you go back into the settings and scroll back down to where it says device care and memory, it will still show four gigabytes. Even though now you're using eight gigabytes, it will still show four gigabytes because four gigabytes the four gigabytes what's showing here is the actual physical RAM. It's not gonna show the virtual RAM, the other four gigs. So it's still gonna remain at four gigabytes. But in theory, you have eight gigabytes of RAM. So as you can see now, the four gigabyte has been added. It's now switched from two to four. So like I mentioned, just remember, it's still going to show four gigabytes of RAM there. But in theory, we now have eight gigabytes of RAM, four gigabytes of physical RAM. And the next four will be virtual RAM. And the next four um, gigabytes of virtual RAM, 
that will only start to get used when it re when the phone really needs to use it. So if you're running a lot of applications and everything at the same time, and the phone starts to slow down, that's when the other four gigabytes of virtual RAM will kick in and start to work alongside the four gigabytes of the virtual RAM. Anyway, that's it for the video. Hope this video helped you out. If it did do, you already know what to do. Give the video a thumbs up. I hope I explained everything good so you all have a better understanding of how it works. And thanks for watching. It's your boy, the Android Doctor, and I'm out. See you in the next one. Deuces.